Hey guys, so we have everything set up here for the 3D printer. Well, everything except the filament itself to 3D print. So we will connect first to the 3D printer and then home all the X's and check the all the speeds. All right. So I'm using Repetier host to connect to the 3D printer and control it. So first we will connect it. All right, we made some sound, so it should be connected. Okay, let's uh, home all the axes. Press X, and now it's doing Y, and now it's doing Z. Okay, it's homed. All right. I will try moving all the axes one by one and see if everything's going good. It's so moving Z first. Okay, let's move it a bit more or faster. I'll hit send. So ZX is moving at 20 millimeters per second. And the max it can go is 12 inches high. Okay, so that's there. Let's try moving the other axis one by one. So X first. So that's at zero position. Now let's move Y. Now my X home position is at X max and my Y home position is at Y max. So I'm doing the opposite direction now. Okay. And that's at Y zero. If I press home again, it'll try to move to the other, other end. Homing X again. And Y. And homing Z. Z homing is a bit slow to prevent any unwanted damage to the nozzle. Which is down here. Now I kept my Z a bit high since I'm just still testing, I don't want to damage my nozzle. So the next step would be to move the Z limit switched up there so I have better control over the nozzle leveling as compared to the bed. After that, we'll get filament and test the extruder itself. And by the way, this is modified cubed extruder. Okay, it's wound again. Okay, see you guys later.